So I noticed that if I'm not feeling particularly happy all the time, it's way too easy to fall into this idea of uh, being depressed or feeling like I'm depressed or just at least the thought form of, oh, I'm depressed comes up. If I'm not, you know, in this constant state of joy and happiness. And I think that has a lot to do with the expectations that are put on us as humans. Um, when we watch things on TV or things that are trying to sell us things, a lot of the stigma goes into this thing's gonna make you happy or you know it'll show people being happy when you buy this product. What I noticed is it's not a healthy way to think to feel like you need to be happy all the time or else you're failing or you're feeling like you're not able to keep up with just being how you're supposed to be. And it's like, I just want to sit here and or stand here and remind you that it's not always about being happy. I think happiness is a wonderful thing, of course, but when it comes down to it, what are we really seeking? What are we really asking for? What is that feeling that we're really looking for? And do we really need to feel happy all of the time or else we feel depressed? No, it doesn't have to be black and white thinking like that. So when I reflected about this in myself, I realized that this had more to do with the expectation of being happy than it was about the feeling itself. And that led me to feel like I wasn't in the right space, that I was doing something wrong. And it's like, no, I'm not doing anything wrong if I'm not constantly feeling joy and happiness. I like to look at nature as an example for a lot of things because we are a part of nature and if you notice the animals out in nature they're pretty much neutral a lot of the times they are kind of just being um and if they're not just being then they're hunting and if they're not hunting they're protecting themselves and they're reproducing and they're doing all of these things. But if you look at it, can you really say that those animals are happy? <laughs> Who's to say, right? We have human emotions, of course, so this is, it's different for us. But I like to bring it back to a different perspective, a mindset shift around this, that instead of striving to be happy all the time, to looking at each day and asking yourself if you were compelled in any way, were you interested by anything? Did anything intrigue you? And that could be as simple as a conversation with somebody or a nice walk down the street and you see a beautiful tree with some new foliage or something that you don't see every day or experience every day. It might not bring you particular happiness, but it could bring you a sense of wonder and peacefulness or a sense of feeling interested by life. And I think that those are kind of things that are maybe overlooked by a lot of people. And so that's why I wanna kind of bring it back. I know it was overlooked by me for a really long time. So I, I just wanted to share this little tidbit that, I was, that was on my mind. And to really free yourself from this expectation of needing to feel happy all the time or else you're failing or something like that. I know that this was so huge for me. 
and you're not doing anything wrong if you're not happy in every moment. Because happiness is a feeling that comes and goes and it is a beautiful thing. And when it comes in the moments, it's an incredible thing to feel gratitude for it. Because the essence of happiness is that it does come and go. And if we were happy all the time, it would ultimately be meaningless because it would just be a constant state of the same thing, which is happiness, but also we would it would fall into the background, right? That would get boring. So just something to think about, something uh, to take a look at in your own life and how you're speaking to yourself um, especially in those days or those time periods where you're feeling less than happy and you want to kind of go into this idea that you're depressed or something like that but in essence you might not be depressed you might just be thinking that you are because you think that there's something wrong with you for not feeling happy so I hope this I hope this brought you a little bit of peace today I hope that it compelled you I hope that it made you kind of look at things a little bit differently and maybe do some reflection in your own life on what makes a day good for you you know, what is it about the day that keeps you feeling like you want to keep going in this life? Taking one step and one foot in front of the other. So, yeah, that could maybe help you gain some direction and get to know yourself a little bit more when it comes to what things give you a sense of wonder about life give you a sense of interest what are those things for you so let me know in the comments and please like and subscribe if this resonated with you i'll see you in the next one